Hey, you, pick up that blood. Welcome back to The Roulette. I'm your host, Michael Riley, with me is Jason Amherst. So, uh, I can't help it. It came out of a can. Well, You want me to pick up that can, too? Yeah, uh, pray. You should pick up the blood with the can, and then you could uh, kill two birds with one stone, I think. <laughs> that's, that's, that's Personally, that's how I would do it, but I can't. So pick up that can. <laughs> and uh, by the way, happy Fourth of July, everybody out there watching this. Hope you're enjoying your Independence Day festivities, whatever those might be. Maybe you had your fireworks before this. Maybe you had your fireworks coming up this weekend. I don't know. Uh, in any event, happy birthday, America. <laughs> uh, please patriot responsibly. Yes. <laughs> He's got a sound for every occasion, folks. And with that, <laughs> since it is July 4th, we're starting the summer of 64. We're putting SNES roulette on the back burner for a bit. And we're going to focus specifically on N64 for a little while. Um, funny enough, we are finally, like, firmly into 1999 on the on the wheel. Uh, with the exception, I think there's actually a game on the wheel that came out in the year 2000. But it was also Year released in. 2000. It was also released in Japan two years before it was released here. So, um, <laughs> yeah, that's why it's on the wheel now. I, I'm going by original release overall, not just in North America. Um, in any event, uh, there's some good stuff on this wheel I, that I'm really hoping we get to. There's also some really trash games, but we'll hopefully we'll be able to veto those. We're starting with four. There's three extra veto spaces on the wheel, but we're capped at six. So if we end up landing on two of them and maxing out, the extra veto just becomes a spin again. In any event, let us do this. I'm spinning the wheel. See what we get. Big bucks, big bucks, no whammies, no whammies. Stop. Here's where we start. South Park. Oh, my favorite game, Accessing Controller Pack. <laughs> <laughs> uh. Okay, let's let's go mediocre first person shooter. Yeah. <laughs> oh my god, I remember the when the Comedy Central logo was that. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> A weirdly sixteen bitish looking acclaim logo. Right. You know, this game has been getting a lot of uh, coverage lately in general, like or just South Park games. Because, like, uh, I, I know uh, Snow Day just came out. I watched a VTuber play it recently. And then uh, uh, AVGN, as part of his Neighbor Nerds uh, series, also covered this with uh, Stick of Truth. Right. Yeah, I was say uh, this is the shit. South Park game before the actual good ones. Yeah. <laughs> Long before the actual good ones. Cause it, yeah, this came out in uh, early 99. Late 98, early 99. I think it literally came out around yeah, Christmas. There wasn't, a lot of, uh, there wasn't a lot of canon or continuity to South Park yet. No. From the deep reaches of space, a horror approaches. It's amazing that they crammed this much into a cartridge, though. That is true. So concentrated, so pure, that no bastion of goodness and decency can stand against it. It hurls through the universe toward its destination. Oh, no, it's a snot ball. <laughs> it was really funny watching the VTuber do it, too, because uh, she, uh, she doesn't speak English very well, and she's just humming to herself. Uncle Fucker. Yeah, I watched that clip. <laughs> <laughs> so she is chat. a dog. She is a dog of uh, of good taste. That and the fact that she actually knew the lyrics to "Let's Fighting Love." <laughs> <laughs> hey, hey, let's go, Kinkasuru. Taisetsu no mono, protect my protect balls. My balls. Boku ga Still one of the best moments. Let's fighting. <laughs> let's fighting. Let's fighting love. Um. Yeah, I just started as Cartman. What the hell was it? I I remember back in the day, uh, Shockwave had a ton of like flash games and stuff that you were able to play with South Park, including a South Park animation maker. 
I should have turned on subtitles. That's all right. Crazy spooky stuff is gonna happen. Yeah, that was a two-part episode, actually. That was. Yeah, there, there was the whole uh, uh, party that the adults were throwing that uh, was mistaken for a doomsday cult. Oh shit! Oh, yeah, this, I really need. Game... I really need the. Uh, I forget which. I think brown eye is the one I want. Also, go ahead and turn those on and turn that on. This this game is considerably better uh, with accoutrements because. Yeah. Oh, <laughs> it, it would be ass without. Yeah. Watching neighbor nerds do it, I was just like, Jesus. <laughs> Come here, Kenny. Yay, Kenny. Well, the uh, I mean, uh... sensitivity on this is really... Oh, oh I forgot that you could put it in letterbox. High res, trademark, low res, and then letterbox, yep. which is very rare for an N64 game. I know uh, this and Jet Force Gemini. Hey, uh, I think Dane's so. here. Dane is here. Holy shit. Okay, you turkey nuts. I, I didn't think you were available today. <laughs> it's more so. Oh, God, this fucking game. Yeah. It's more so that the thing that I was doing got moved up. Oh. Okay. Well, that's that's good. I'm glad you're able to be here for at least for at least uh, for at least this. And, I don't know how I don't know how long you're going to be here, but and I have an audition for the Pink Panther because apparently Ooh. they made a play version of the Pink Panther. Nice, nice. And it's either on Wednesday or Thursday. So. Well, I'm not available either of those days, so that's fine by me. <laughs> I, I, I've only got one, or am I? Is it when, or is it this Wednesday or Thursday that I'm available? And maybe it's the next week I'm thinking about. I forget. Let me look. So. Uh, oh yeah, no, we have stuff scheduled. We have a we have a, we have record scheduled for Wednesday and Thursday. <laughs> so shit. <laughs> well, I can let you know as soon as I know. Which day? Okay. I'd I mean, listen. Kinda... I'm telling you now instead of telling you at the last minute. So I I, I, I do I do appreciate that. It just sucks that we're losing yet another record day. When we're going to be there's going to be a week coming well, up where we're only going to have one. I mean, like, see, you know, <laughs> there are other capable adults in this case. Yes, but that's, that's if they're around. Yeah, you know, the problem is, I'm, is that I'm I can't at work. <laughs> yeah, if Jason's at work, I can't rely on him to be there the whole show because if he has to, he if he has to duck out and deal with something, then it just becomes well, backseat lonesome. And nobody wants to watch that. Of, if Billy would get his fat ass out. Of now I will say, if it's Thursday that you have to. Do the audition, that's okay, because then we can still record that day, because Ashley will be available. Okay. But outside of that, like, if it's Wednesday, we'll have to straight up cancel that. So I'm actually, I'm hoping, I'm hoping your audition is Thursday. <laughs> For selfish reasons. Thanks How do you get out of this goddamn fucking Thanks town? For putting the pressure on I'm not putting the pressure on you. I'm putting the pressure on your fucking the producers of your the play. I want them to select the right day. You don't have anything to do with that. So or, don't or don't Billy so, could just you know yeah. commit to the bit. Yeah. Shut your ding dang and pile. Yeah, I wasn't putting any blame or pressure on you whatsoever, Dane. You're not involved with the production as. Uh, in that in that way, oh, dude. <laughs> I, I'd like to see somebody remake this game and make it like good. Make it good. <laughs> yeah, yeah. That ain't no lie. I forget where I gotta go. 
I thought there was you know, like a gotta, way out of town somewhere. I actually, I actually know what you have to do. All right, listen very carefully. You um, I'm put this control scheme back on to rock because I'm having issues with the. So here, okay. So here's what you do: you go to the pause menu, hit quick game. Oh, I see. Exit out of this game. <laughs> you were actually listening to me too. <laughs> yeah. This game is ass. There's no doubt about that. Hey, this game, it's ass. Seriously. I mean, wait till you get to Chef's Love Shack. Oh, God. <laughs> I that, that'll more. be coming. The, the further we yeah, get, we the further we get into the library, uh, yeah, the the more release, the the faster pace the releases will be. Because, <laughs> like I said, the, our wheel our wheel right now is firmly into 1999. The later uh, it, it, the games on it are uh, from a lot of the ones that I, were added today are from 1999, early January and February. Wasn't and there's there also, also a South Park, uh, uh, Mario Park, yeah, clone. South Park Rally, South, yeah. yeah, South Park Rally, yep. yep. And I believe that game fucking sucked too. Yeah. I played it on MVG Live once. I'm trying to remember. Uh, what, weren't, weren't the turkeys voiced by a uh, guest celebrity in the episode? I don't remember. Possibly. Because that was, that was one of the running jokes of uh, South Park early on. Is they were uh, forced to have celebrities... And they would cast them in the dumbest roles possible. Supposedly, Jerry Seinfeld was offered the uh, turkey. Okay. <laughs> That's fucking ridiculous. <laughs> I'm a turkey! Oh my god! <laughs> no! If being on this show is so... If, is this show so popular... Then uh, maybe uh, may maybe I can uh, meet some uh, hot young chicks. Don't maybe no, maybe Jerry. that's why they gave him the role of turkey. Straight up turkey. <laughs> Jesus <laughs> Christ. This is so chaotic and freaking... <laughs> My kingdom for another weapon. My I God. Know, right? I, don't, I only have the... Snowball. Is everybody... Is anybody really... that, uh... surprised that this fucking sucked? Not really. No, not at all. Th there was almost a, like, moderately, uh... competent Game Boy Color South Park game. Uh, and it never came out. Oh, I, you know, I, I forgot, because I'm looking at the list of South Park guest stars. Yeah. Jonathan Katz actually voiced Dr. Katz in a season two episode. Oh, yeah. Well, because it was a Comedy Central show, so. Oh, uh, yeah. It's me and Jonathan uh, Katz. All we do. Co corporate synergy, you know, well before, uh, you know, these Hollywood companies bought each other out. Mm -hmm. George I mean, Clooney uh, was Sparky the dog. Yep, I remember. Because uh, uh, Simpsons had uh, I think the, the kick critic balls in here. Yeah. <laughs> oh, give this man the prize. This isn't America's funniest home videos, but a ball hitting a guy in the crotch. It works on so many levels. Oink. <laughs> Sherman, I just realized that you were making fun of me. Now you must die. Uh, hey, Nudnik, your shoelaces are untied. Perhaps I shall go in for a closer inspection. Upon further inspection, these are loafers. On small men pictures presents Presents. man getting hit by football. Oh! Let's just say it moved. To our, to bigger our bigger house! Oh, wait, I said the quiet part loud and the loud part quiet.
<laughs> Turkey for breakfast? Yeah, makes sense. In the Cartman household, I think. Mm. <laughs> what? I don't. I, I, there's just something about the animation of the goat getting hit by the uh, by the ball and just the shaking goat, its head like the goat shrugged it off the... and then fell over. Yeah. Yeah. Crazy. Sweet. <laughs> hmm. Uh, this would be even funnier if uh, all the turkeys actually did sound like Jerry Seinfeld. Gobble, 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 I said he did date a seventeen-year-old. That's right, Peter. <laughs> That's not very alpha behavior, Jerry. <laughs> it's actually kind of disgusting, Jerry. Kramer walks in. Oh. She's a minor. She's a minor. <laughs> <laughs> That's right, Kramer. We're not talking about the people who go with with the picks and the canaries. Again, Newman comes in. I always knew Jerry would hang himself with his own rope. Oh, also, Jerry, I died in Jurassic Park. Are you Wayne Knight? It's still, <laughs> it's still a more notable uh, movie career than you ever had. Finish. I also, also, I looked at. Um, what the heck's her name from Indecent? Uh... Oh, now this is going to bug me. Hang on. <clears throat> <laughs> Two innocent creatures needlessly KO'd. <laughs> oh. Yeah, but I killed three, so that means one of them was was, was not was an innocent creature. Was technically a minion. Yeah. yeah. Either, the bear, either the bear, the goat, or the deer. <laughs> Jerry, I also saw Sharon Stone's snatch in... Basic instinct, Jerry. <laughs> Mr. Hat sucks ass. <laughs> Operation, Operation Turkey Butt. <laughs> Chefs love Shaq. Oh, there it is. Suck on my chocolate salty balls. Chef, right. Stick them in your mouth and suck them. <laughs> he just randomly has a woman in his bed. Little turkey, little turkey with the big turkey, the turkey with the turkey with the turkey. Bunch of turkeys. <laughs> Scientology children. <laughs> Zenu children. Good Zenus children. <laughs> they killed my character off, children. All right. Thoughts on South Park, Dane? Um, the game. <laughs> there's real. There's really. No good South Park game until Fractured Butthole. Stick, Stick of Truth is good too. Oh yeah, I thought that came after Fractured Butthole. No, no Stick of Truth uh, came first actually. <laughs> okay, so then let me rephrase that. There wasn't a good South Park game until Stick of Truth. Yes. Up until yeah. then, <laughs> it was shit, it was shit like this and Chef's Love Shack. These games are just terrible, absolutely terrible. Jason. Yeah, I mean, uh, if I'm not mistaken, wasn't this also the Turok engine on top of it all? How yes, did they manage to that's make that why the suck? control screen, the first uh, control setting was to rock. <laughs> yeah, yeah like, like, how did they manage to make Turok suck so bad? Uh, they found a way. <laughs> Like so, yeah, Tur uh, with, Turok with, was a with a licensed property. Right, Turok, Turok <laughs> was a lot more fun to play. Um, I this is a, one of the games I used to own. Uh, I probably still have a copy of it lying around somewhere if I find it. But um, yeah, it's 
it's it's okay. It's not really that great. It's I don't. I'm not gonna say it's like the worst thing in the world because it really isn't. But it's not. It's not really a great game. Um, eh. Scores out of ten, Dane. Speak for yourself. This game sucks. I give it a one. Jason. Four. I'll give it a three. All right. Uh, on to the second game of the episode. Uh, I was underwhelmed by oh, a shit. soda, and I unfortunately bought two of them. So the other one, I'm gonna have to find out what booze it pairs best with. Ooh, Hudson! Here we go, baby! What the heck? Ciao! It's your buddy Alfonso. How's summer break? Don't forget your homework. Couldn't help but over here. You're having a race to see who can get a girlfriend first. In two weeks? Oh, God, this is a fucking neck beer kind Bravo, of Bravo, wonderful. As an Italian who lives and breathes love, I have to see you put your pride on the line. Let's have a battlefield. I'll be helping out, too. One million roses to every girl in the world. Oh, what the fuck is this? It's Mario Party meets Dating Sim. It's, it's Get Her Love. La, La Panda Love Unit. <laughs> uh, nice. It's the game that just very, very recently got a full translation. You know... I have a suspicion that if I put a veto in, that Jace will shoot me down. Like, it's a Mario Party game for crying out loud, dude! It's to... going to be good. As I said, Jace has been wanting to see this game, so uh, yeah, your veto will oh, probably go and heat up. Fine, fine, fine. I mean, we have four of them, but <laughs> Panda, Panda, love you, and give me a fucking break. <laughs> 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 Too bad Billy ain't here. Billy would be like, "Shut up, no veto." <laughs> <laughs> Shut up, Don Vito. You're just you're just mad because I didn't use the veto on NHL. That too. He wasn't gonna veto I had this. To su- I had to, Jason I had wasn't to gonna veto this through... at, at, for any reason. I don't. It wouldn't have mattered. I I suffered through hockey. You're gonna suffer through Mario Party dating sim. Oh. Give me a break, you prick. <laughs> Sports games are boring as hell, and I will stand by that. <laughs> oh, yeah? Well, visual novel games make me... You know I can't read. Mmm. <laughs> exactly. Exactly. <laughs> That's all I hear in my head right now. <laughs> all right, let's play. Meanwhile, I'm just sitting here. <laughs> I mean, just just look at this fabulous, not Fabio dude, you know, oh. hosting the game. Look, I wonder how many wieners can fit in his mouth. Look at that. All, all oh of them. yes, let's go, ciao! <laughs> now I, I, I was gonna, I was gonna say Happy Pride because we are recording this in Pride Month, but it, this this episode, as I pointed out at the beginning of the show, at the beginning of the show, this episode airs on on Independence Day. So, <laughs> really, <laughs> yep, yeah, it's so, it's Pride Month every month when you're gay. That's fair. That's fair. All corporations during Pride Month. I am once again gay. <laughs> Give me your gay money! Why did Why did your spokesperson turn into uh, Joe Swanson? It was uh, no, it was Bernie Sanders, but yeah. Well, let me tell you something. I, <laughs> I am sending you today to ask you, Bernie. Me. Yes, let's go. Hey, listen to me. I want to give all these fairies um... skinhead. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Well, you gotta go. You gotta go with skinhead. Right. Well. He's very happy. Once again, asking you, where is the soup? Select. (laughs) Okay. Is this like select your regional dialect? I guess. Uh, Too too bad you're Bernie because like the bro thing is totally on uh, brand for uh, friggin' uh, Russo. Like this, bro. (laughs) I got to do like this. Bro, 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 bro. Bro, 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 bro. Grazie. <laughs> Listen, bro, for a Pride Month, we're doing a dildo on a pole, Mac, bro. It's going to be great, bro. Her name was... What, what What? was the girl? 
Ayumi. Ayumi. Let's get her over here. Oh my god. <laughs> I I'm beginning to see where like <clears throat> these generic artists like got their style for like these toy dolls and stuff like that, like the brats. I... Ayumi's excited because she just uh... graduated the fifth grade. Uh you're you're wild, bro. All right. <laughs> I, I love the weird mascot statue in the background, too. <laughs> it's like a freaking teddy bear man with a mustache. <laughs> Day one. Sun. All right. The music's really freaking good. What, uh, what, what am I supposed okay, to Okay, so I guess you get to pick a location on the map. All right. Let's go! Let's go! Look at all these people dancing. This what is this is incredibly bizarre, <laughs> but I love it because it's so weird. I'm oh, finally I, at the field. I, I'm in, in the football club, but I don't but turn. I up. Don't turn up. That's right. I turned I, down for what? <laughs> I, I I I skip my own club that I go to. Whoops. Mm. Uh, Mr. and Mrs. Hongo appeared. Oh, no. <laughs> Not Mr. and Mrs. Hongo. Hello there, young man. Would you like to work for a short while? I see um... you're skipping your club. <laughs> we'll pay you 5,000 yen. That was worth a lot back in the 90s. Oh, that... That was before the economic bubble burst. Yikes. You're a big help. <laughs> Wait, what are... Yeah. <laughs> yeah, let's put these high schoolers to work, you know, in freaking hard, laborious tasks like, you know, jackhammering. Yeah. <laughs> well, to be fair, I don't think Mr. Hondo can do can can do jackhammering like that. Oh. He's hey, making on. he's making a girl he likes move. Oh. Uh, oh, okay. No, he's making he's making himself move, I guess. The angel panda descended. What? What? Oh, that must be the uh, the weird mascot thing there in the like the the mascot statue was supposed to be a panda, I guess. He lost both style and stamina, so he needed to use that card, even though he got the money. Okay, so All this right. is you. This is me. Okay, you're at the amusement center. <laughs> I'm a center. panda fun, bro. Where should I go? Oh, karaoke corner. Hell yeah. I'm a karaoke corner, bro. The prices are changed depending on the time, bro. Okay, not Suki is here, bro. What should I do? Um, talk. Talk to Natsuki. <laughs> huh? Pankichi. Wow, nice to see you. And Shiki. Do you come here often, Panchi? Pankichi? My name's Bernie. What the? Oh crap, Bernie, right? Sorry, I got your name wrong. <laughs> I don't know what. I'll be more careful know. next time. <laughs> uh, she's she's yeah. supposed to be like an airheaded uh, like country girl, I guess. I'll have to talk uh, to her again, her. bro. Oh, I got style and stamina for that. Nice. Oh. That worked out in my favor. This is so freaking weird, but I love it. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> <laughs> yes, I'm at Info Center. Might as well look at the info while I'm here. What you else would you do at the Info Center? <laughs> Ciao! How's it going? Gotta enjoy that summer break! Oh, <laughs> Will you lend me your ears, child? Well, no, they're kind of attached to my head. I think I need an adult right now. <laughs> <laughs> it's important to talk to a lot of girls, Is however. It? However, Aren't I... you forgetting something? If you want to be loved, you must love yourself. Okay, you know what? That that's nice. That's a very nice. That's message. a very nice sentiment. What shall I do? I guess I'll jack off. <laughs> <laughs> Practice self love. <laughs> yeah, in the middle of a crowded ball, <laughs> in front of everybody. I swear to God, if that's an option. <clears throat> I see. So it's not going swimmingly, is it? Well, because you're. Then here's something that should help. Check your items later. Check your items later. 
Well then, ciao, break a leg. Um, <laughs> nice, I got a present, which is great because I have no future. Good rumor, Good card. rumor card. I got a present from a strange <laughs> Italian man. <laughs> <laughs> I got a. Hey, listen. Listen, 25 years ago, I got a present from a strange Italian man, his friendship. And it's worked out very well for me. Oh, isn't that nice? <laughs> um, um, excuse me? Um, <laughs> um, I'll buy <laughs> diarrhea cards. <laughs> <laughs> I quit. I where's, quit. where's Billy? <laughs> what the fuck is this shit? Fuck this. I give this game zero. Goodbye. <laughs> what the fuck? Why would you? Is that? Does that just force diarrhea on you, <laughs> or whoever you use it on? Oh my god. Listen, close your butthole. He's at Panda Park. <laughs> Hell yeah, park. I'll get Hell some. Hell yeah, get some clothes at the. That's You're... right, because up are until you now. Why clothes at the park? That's right, because up until now You're I was to buy butt ass at the naked. Soup store. I came to this park naked. I'm Rob Bass, and I came to fuck clowns. <laughs> hey, it's Hannah. What do I do? Well, probably put some clothes on you, fuck nut. Uh, uh, chew. No, I am actually Protestant. <laughs> uh, now my nose is trembling. <laughs> Damn it, I'm out of tissues. <clears throat> hmm, Takashi, you got any tissues? <laughs> nah, you're a lifesaver. Uh, uh, you're a lifesaver. She must be from Osaka. Uh, it's supposed to be like a southern accent, maybe. Tissue, well, I barely know you. <laughs> Amazing. Just giving somebody a tissue is enough to, you know... Potentially get a date. <laughs> I helped her blow her nose. Maybe she'll fuck me. <laughs> Listen, I'm still wrapping my head around my <laughs> diarrhea card. Yeah, no, I'm still diarrhea having. I'm card. having. I'm having issues uh, coming to terms with that myself. Nokia. Uh, it's it's an appropriate uh, era ringtone. <laughs> I'm going to cafe liquid. Cafe liquid. Oh, liquor. that's what that diarrhea card will come in real handy. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Oh, I know what the diarrhea card is now. Oh, crap. Uh, it's a card with diarrhea. I don't think it needs to be explained, Jason. The diarrhea card? Oh, crap. Oh, I get it. <laughs> Jesus, this guy's phone. He's this guy's phone right is high. just drinking off, ringing off the, uh, you know, chain. We'll just doss about. Doss about. Doss about. Sweet. I can't um, wait to play and... some Doom. <laughs> odd, odd, uh, odd choice of slang. I guess the park was uh, was one of the good places to go. Fuck if I know. Is it time to? Yep, oh, it looks like we're gonna. All right, um, let's go to the. Cafe. Let's go to Cafe Liquid. Why not? I want to see the diarrhea <laughs> card in action. <laughs> Get some diarrhea in a cup. Oh, that's what I call Starbucks. Yeah. What the? I, I, I will refute a little bit. I've never had it a diarrhea after having Starbucks. But all right, I'm at Cafe Liquid. I'm gonna be like Kaoru in the future. What do I do? How's it going? Good. How'd they p get Jason into this game? <laughs> <laughs> I am Keanu Kaoru. Jason with hair. <laughs> and, and interesting glasses. I mean, I'm always. I, I feel like I'm I feel like J them. I was gonna say I feel like Jason has a pair just like that. <laughs> not not quite. All of mine are shiny, like they're <laughs> reflective. You can't see my eyes. I keep telling you guys where these girls are going. But keep, keep in mind. mind that my word isn't gospel. Okay. So no, that's a that's a panic. At, that's a panic at the disco song. Uh, they have places I need to go to, you know, like the bathroom. You idiot. Oh, did they also have a diarrhea card? Not Sakeito. Oh, so you can, oh. you can ask this dude where the girls are going. 
so you can try to meet them at those but locations. But he literally just said, my word is in gospel. So now <laughs> yeah, it's like so like it's a coin toss on yeah. whether or not it's going to work. Uh oh. Well, Did everybody, right, go, everybody to the go to that cafe? I guess. Oh, he's talking to Ka Kaoru. Is a popular dude. <laughs> oh, you know what? Did, if I had background music like that, I'd be popular too. I guess. <laughs> Isn't this place clean today? <laughs> Makoto helped me, uh, came by this morning and helped me clean. That girl's not all bad, you know. Her brother and I go way back. We've been friends since this place first opened. You got a topic got ball. A topic. How about a nice used ball, man? Are you sure? Yeah, so, uh... I, I hear she's coming here. Did that help? Drop by for some coffee if you're bored. See ya. The angel that, panda that looks winks less at you. like a... Uh... How did how did her feelings for him? Be? I'm so confused. He's, he keeps losing style and stamina, though. Yeah. Whoop. What? Ayumi. Oh, Chikashi. <laughs> so delish. This cup here is so delish. So she's right. supposed. To, I think she's supposed to be posh. Are yeah. you free tomorrow night? Tomorrow? I want to go to Panda Burger. That's almost a real restaurant. <laughs> Let's meet up at Panda Burger tomorrow night. I hope they don't actually make their burgers out of pandas. I think that's illegal. <laughs> well, <laughs> you can't do that. It's illegal. It's illegal. <sighs> ah, finally, it's my turn. I'm a cafe liquid, bro. Come here, man, because we real feel grown up, bro. Oh, Ayumi is here, bro. Oh, Chikashi's here, bro. Asesu is here, bro. What should I do? Well, I have a literally a whole lot of people well, I can talk to here. I, Ayumi is like the one that you're supposed to be going after, so. I will talk to her. Oh, Bernie. You know, I totes <laughs> love this place. No, she's Valley Girl, totally. <laughs> All right. Panda merch is totally in right now. Pankichi dolls are basically everywhere. I have a Pankichi plush. That's an odd way of uh, describing. Why does she look so sick? But I don't have the one that's popular. They're too popular. They're always sold out. Uh. Uh. Where should I take her? Oh, uh, she she wants to check out uh, Panda Burger. Yeah, but you gotta also remember, she's going tomorrow night to Panda Burger. Uh. Okay. So I'll take her. Tuesday evening. Be beat him to the punch! <laughs> I'll wait for you, Panda Burger. Don't forget where we're going, okay? It's a date, bro! <laughs> got to talk to Ayumi, bro. Bro, 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 bro. Bro, 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 bro. Boy, is the segment over already? Oh, gee whiz. <laughs> I think literally everybody that went to the cafe on this turn, I think I'll play some billiards. Oh, it's Ayumi. Oh, it's Bernie. Oh, it's Shikashi. Oh, it's Seshu. Oh, what should I do? Oh, God. Oh, fuck. Oh, shit. <laughs> oh, shit. Love bonus. Um. Oh, she wants to take pictures together. All right. Bro, bro, bro. Panda bro, Burger. Panda Burger. Sunday bro. night. Uh oh. <laughs> Oh shit! Oh shit! I should have said Sunday night. Fuck! I didn't realize that Man. was. A... She she must really like them burgers. <laughs> yeah, she's getting them three days in a row. Uh... Crazy USA hamburger, yes. Literally everybody wants a cafe liquid. Hey, there goes my phone. Yo, it's Hannah. Want to go somewhere tomorrow night? Yeah, we can go to Karaoke Corner. Oh no! She, what an he, idiot! He was already on a date Monday night. Oh! So he can't. Did I do something wrong? Whatever. Bad guy! <laughs> <laughs> mm -hmm. All right. I, idiot! Uh... Oh, wait a minute. It's evening now. 
I think we're gonna we're gonna end the segment here. Th- this is uh oh thoughts on Getter Love Dane. Yes, you're one of my best friends, and <laughs> I I respect your opinion a lot. But we're no longer but friends. I, I, no, I'm just kidding. <laughs> no, I'm kidding. I really I just don't get the appeal of things like this. Maybe it's because I'm not an anime connoisseur. Maybe it's because you have a lot more experience with anime, but I just look at these things and I'm like, what the fuck is that? What is this? What is that? I don't get it. Diarrhea card. Just... <laughs> <laughs> Diarrhea card, indeed. <laughs> Jason. Uh, you know, I mean, probably because I've studied Japanese culture and history and pop culture and everything for years. This is one of these things where it's like this is highly amusing to me. Also, it's it's sort of a time capsule of sorts because like Japan had the whole bubble economy and was going through like a big like boom in the 80s and 90s. <sighs> so like this is really a time capsule of what life in that time period was like. Um it's not going to be for everyone. This is a hardcore weeb game. Which is why I'm kind of disappointed that Billy's not here to experience this, because he would be laughing his ass off right now. <laughs> but yeah, like I, I, I thought that this was interesting. Like you know, there, there are certainly worse board game like games that you can play. I mean, you could have been playing Fortune Street. It's basically Monopoly with extra steps and yep. even more capitalism. Yep. And Mario characters, if you're playing it on GameCube or Wii or whatever. Um, but yeah. yeah, it's it's strange. Um, when I when I heard it was described as, as Mario Party Dating Simulator, uh, I, I was actually kind of looking forward to it because I love Mario Party. In fact, Mario Party is on the wheel, I believe. <laughs> Strangely, um, yeah. But uh, it's not exactly the same as Mario Party. It's still quite. It's it's amusing to watch, um, and and it, it it's not that bad to play either. So uh, it's it's fine. Scores out of ten, Dane. Two, Jason. Six. I'll give it a four. All right, one more. I give this game three diarrhea. <laughs> All right, we got one more game to play this episode. See what it be. Three diarrheas. God damn. <laughs> ah, that dude's got that dude's asshole got torn out. <laughs> so apparently, according to the uh, walkthrough, the diary you can give the diarrhea card to an opponent. And when they get to their location, their turn automatically ends because dot 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 they get diarrhea question mark. <laughs> Have oh. to go to the bathroom. <laughs> this is some funky music. Yeah. Up down Tetris. Uh, yeah, I don't know what that means. Um, oh, story mode and versus mode. Didn't we talk about this in a past episode? Uh, well, yeah, because this never came out, uh, or, or it came out on PlayStation, I believe, but it was an arcade game first, and then it came out on N64 and PlayStation, I believe. One day, Donald went fishing and caught a stone mm-hmm. that glowed mysteriously. There were weird symbols carved into the stone. <laughs> Donald thought to himself, yeah. How the fuck would Goofy know? And he said, sure, "Ask the Goofy's dumbest heart. member of the group about what this mysterious magical stone could be." I was gonna say, Goofy's is... My name is Goof, Goof Goofy, and I have thirty-eight degrees in yucking. <laughs> you're just in time. I was about to yuck. Uh, why don't Why don't you change out? Why don't yeah. you? Yeah. Oh, give the, me a, hey. Take all your clothes off, Donald. <laughs> your ducky slut. Your dick's ducky already slut. hanging out. I don't know. You can't really be more naked than you already are. Wait, <laughs> he has to help. 
Donald has to help Goofy in order for the... Oh my god. Okay. No, 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 no. I'm gonna bait your ducky ass. They just watch me. So, uh, so I, uh... I tried toxic waste slime liquor sour soda today. Strawberry flavor. Well, that's a mouthful. Yeah. Um, it was not worth the three bucks for the bottle. And I bought two of them because I'm going to try to... Now that I know that one of them is disappointing, I got all three flavors. So uh, I have another strawberry, a blue raz, and then one that just says sour soda. I have no clue what that one's going to taste like. But yeah, I'm pairing them all with booze. Screw it. <laughs> like, I mean, I, I, I'm like, this was such an underwhelming soda compared to the other one that I tried right after it. Uh, pork so. soda. I, I tried a uh, frosty blue cream soda. And god damn, that was amazing. Is that an actual soda or is that a... Uh... Uh, Frosty is a registered trademark of the Frosty Root Beer Company. Uh, it is, uh, apparently, uh, made in Michigan. Hmm. And, uh, I picked up, uh, two bottles of the cream soda. Uh, actually, I picked up, like, two bottles of each of the Frosty ones, because I tried the blue cream before, and it was really good. But, like, they had a cherry limeade and a root beer, and they were only a buck fifty a piece, compared to, like, the slime liquors, which were, like, three bucks a piece. Yay, I won. Woo! Wow, Donald, you're kind of an asshole. Isn't Goofy supposed to be your friend? Thanks, Donald. Thanks. You sure helped me out by kicking my fucking ass. Uh, <laughs> you kicked my gilkin' ass. <laughs> what did you want to ask me? I'll stop jacking off for two seconds. Corkscrew penis. Gosh, I've never seen anything like that. <laughs> <laughs> Saying that right after Jay said corkscrew penis. <laughs> hey, Donald. <laughs> Mickey might know one of these. He's over at Minnie's house right now. He might be yucking. <laughs> Why don't you go over and visit <laughs> Okay. Uh, uh, gosh, really? Thank you, you fucking weirdo. <laughs> Did you just call me Mickey, you fucking idiot? <laughs> <laughs> Mickey went, just went back to his factory. <laughs> By the way, you know factory. the factory that Mickey's always had. <laughs> By the way, you've come just in time. I'm down 40. the fuck. I was just saying, <laughs> making some cookies now. Yeah. <laughs> oh boy. That was a cake in there. No, the cake is First a lie. All, <laughs> how does one make cookies by playing Tetris? Well, we're finding out. Yeah, I mean, this is not Yoshi's cookie. This is magical Tetris. This isn't even robotics mean bean machine. Listen, I did it all for the cookie. The cookie. So you can take that nookie. And stick it up your other end. I don't The one opposite of your yeah. <laughs> I, I do like the fact that this uh, Tetris game actually, you know, it's it's more classic Tetris without the hand-holding of the uh, uh, reserve slot. Yes. You know, to me, I'm already this this the storyline's a little the strange fuck? because as because as Jace pointed out. What the, what the fuck? Screams. Oh, yeah, she's throwing garbage pieces your way. Minnie. I'm so they're, confused. They're, not, uh, they're non standard tetrominoes. Yeah. They're not, yeah, no they're not four squares. But as I was saying, this, this story mode is already kind of weird because 
Yeah, as Jace pointed out, Donald sees strange ruins on a stone. Oh, Goofy, the dumbest member of this party, might know what this is. What the heck are you trying to say? What the? Are you saying I'm hucking stupid, boy? I'll huck you up! I'll huck and cut I'll you, I'll huck your dick! What? Um... <laughs> Excuse me? You want you wanna know what happened to Horace Horse Collar? I yuck and killed him. Boris Horsecock? Boris Horsecock, that is correct. <laughs> oh, okay. Glad we figured that out. Oh Jesus! I'm... Oh Jesus! <laughs> no! I can't I don't uh -oh. gotta know where to put this shit. I can't Minnie. do shit with these! Minnie! Minnie, you fucking what the fuck? dick bag! Minnie, you bitch! Lick my ass, Minnie. Oh my god. I'm, this game I'm went from fucked. easy I to suddenly, so like, fucked. ass crunchingly hard. Uh, Minnie is ruthless. Minnie just fucking destroyed my duck ass. <laughs> my you know god. What? You should call Daisy and be like, Daisy, are you gonna let Minnie do this to me? <laughs> Daisy, <laughs> Minnie, <laughs> Minnie just molested me. <laughs> What? Uh, Minnie just violated me. So uh, Minnie, can... Minnie took one look at Donald and was like, <laughs> "Minnie, you goddamn weeb!" <laughs> Having Howard the Duck flashbacks. <laughs> oh God! Yeah, here comes the garbage pieces again. Donald oh, just shit. like. Uh, that's all right. Clear that. <laughs> yeah. Listen, in terms of Howard the Duck, you ever wanted to see Leah Thompson fuck a duck? Pentress! Pentress? Oh, did she clear five lines at once? Yeah. She used one of those gray long pieces. Mm. That fucking mouse cunt. <laughs> hey, what, what's your problem, bro? Bro, 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 bro! Oh. Nice. I'm Vince Russo. Oh, bro. magic. <laughs> magic! <laughs> Ow! I got a, uh... Squad alive! We are Oof. off! Ah, uh, son of a bitch. This is a non-standard piece. These, these five pieces are freaking really bad. Yeah. I think that's the idea. They're supposed to be shitty. You know what? Like buddy. this is this is enough of a shakeup of the Tetris formula, though. That I, I'm I'm digging it. Yeah, I'm actually really enjoying this. Despite it, the the changes, make it fun enough to be like it's not just Tetris. It's there. There's more to it than that, and you got to really think strategically, especially when it gives you these bullshit pieces. Like I said, it's it's. It's the Disney version of Mean Bean Machine. Yep, pretty much. Yeah. Oh, you can fuck right off, Minnie. Fuck absolutely off. Thank you. Oh, give me a long piece now, bitch. Oh, oh, oh Pinterest! Pinterest, baby! Pinterest! Eat my duck ass! You fuck stick. <laughs> uh, she just had a magic clear thing happen. Well, listen, too. she's sending garbage right back at you. I'm aware. I see it on the side of my screen. I'm trying to clear it as fast as I possibly can. I'm not really. I don't really have anything for the, her to pile garbage onto at the moment. Thank God. That Pinterest yeah. really did me some good. She just got a Tetris. I'm aware. Oh, I'm guessing as the time counts up, the level goes higher. I probably yeah. Because right now it's like level four. Uh, piss! I hate this. Damn. All right, no, it's okay. What? I that was actually the perfect piece. Oh shit! And then I fucked it up immediately. Um. Hey, you you can recover. I I can. I'll have to figure it out. 
Oh, Jesus. Oh, Jesus. Look what Jesus did. Look what Jesus did. Okay, okay. All right, hold on. Jesus! There was five of them. I mean, that's what a Pentress is. Five of them. Yeah. <laughs> the fuck do I even do with that? <laughs> what do I do? What do I do, do? I mean, do? I, I, I saw something, but it's really hard to backseat Tetris. Yeah, because you're kind of got to be thinking a couple steps ahead. Oh, piss off, Minnie. Oh, God. Oh, Minnie's going to fuck my ass Pinterest. again. She's going to put a Pinterest right in my buttress. <laughs> well, that's, uh, sounds like a you, uh-oh. Sounds like oh, a you. Oh, cr oh, cry. Oh, Christ. <laughs> oh, man. Oh. She gave me a fucking 25 block <laughs> tetrometer. Holy Minnie, crap. Minnie stole. Victory. Mini is a real dick. <laughs> God. If it weren't for the Disney license, I would love a remake of this just because I want to take on this challenge. By the way, I should what, point what? out, this is on very easy, too, by the way. <laughs> it really makes me look bad. Normal? I don't have any idea. Uh, Watch it be one of them rare games that goes for, like, hundreds of uh, thousands of dollars and shit. <sighs> Magical Tetris Challenge on N64. Uh, loose cartridge averages about 1915. Complete in box 7625. Oh, for fuck's sake with this. That's not too bad. Yeah. Uh, Game Boy Color, loose 20 bucks. Hmm. Okay, good. So, well, that's not, yeah, color. that's not terrible, then. Um, this was never released stateside on the PlayStation, though. Only released on the PlayStation uh, in uh, Europe. So, ew, pal! Get that 50 hertz out of my face. <laughs> Jesus. Okay, oh, 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 you I, did a thing. I did a thing, and I'm about to immediately Tetris. Get Boom! fucked. Get absolutely fucked, Minnie. You little bitch. You know, you guys are getting way too mad at a cartoon mouse. <laughs> She's a dick fuck. Way to set me up Magic. for a Pentress, like, almost immediately. I'll just clear some know, lines right? out here. God, imagine if Fievel was here. You guys would be having a field day. Oh, what? You missing your family, Fievel? You... Flag, flag bearer. Whoa, careful. <laughs> he said flag, everybody. Oh, jeez. Oh, my <laughs> fucking God. Are you serious? Okay. Oh, beautiful. That helped out. That helped out tremendously. On, Eat man. piss. <laughs> Ito pissuru! Ito kangaroo you drink, pissuru! You actually drink piss, you idiot. Oh, cock. Uh, right Jesus. there. Jesus! Oh, Jesus! What the? Help! Well, uh, if, if you don't instant drop, you could tuck that square right into that little corner there. Well, my problem now is... <laughs> you, you keep dropping them there, like, just... Down and then to the left. Back thanks, the pruder. Say, yeah, they, they, thanks, the pruder. <laughs> <laughs> oh Jesus! Oh Lord! Oh come on, really? I'm going to block myself off. <laughs> it's fine. It's fine. It's fine. Oh my God! You won! Oh! Have confidence! Whoa! 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 Thoughts, whoa! Thoughts on whoa! thoughts on magical Tetris challenge, Dane. Um, that was actually pretty fun. Uh, yeah. Despite uh, the fact that you know, Minnie was kind of a kind of mean. She's but, a douche canoe. She's a douche canoe. 
Jason. You know, I'm only convinced that this game gets harder. And you know what? I am beyond curious to find out how much harder this game gets after the bullfuckery that, that they throw at you in just the second stage alone on very easy. Uh, I am I am very amused. This this is quite possibly the most interesting Tetris since Tetris DS. And considering this predates it by a number of years, that's saying something. Uh, I am still a major fan of the new Tetris, which is the N64 game that comes out shortly after this. Like it, we'll we'll get to it at, at eventually. It's it's coming up very soon. But that being said, this is fantastic. I don't think if this was a regular Tetris game with absolutely no gimmicks, it wouldn't be as good. With the gimmicks that it has, with the the the, the those garbage pieces that you get that you have to try to make fit. Like, that is fucking genius. I love this game. This is great. And it's up there with new Tetris for me for my favorite Tetris games. Um, scores out of 10, Dane. Nine. Jason. Nine. I'm going to give it a 10. It's that good. On this edition of the show, we played South Park Get Her Love and Magical Tetris Challenge. Best game of the episode, Dane. Magical Tetris Challenge. That's great, Dane. Thank you. Jason. <laughs> I'm assuming that's what he's picking anyway. So, he... Yeah, I mean, the, the weeb in me says get her love, but I mean, clearly this game is just... This is this is a game you can play with anybody. Like, Magical Tetris Challenge is going to be good no matter what. Absolutely. Get her love is only good with certain audiences. So Yeah, uh, I, I am choosing Magical Tetris Challenge as well. I, 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 can't, I can't think of a, a better... A better way to end this episode. Thank you guys for joining us for this edition of Retro Roulette. If you like what we do, please hit subscribe and be sure to hit the bell to be notified of upcoming videos. For Dane, for Jonah, Jason Amherst, I'm Mike Riley saying see you next time.